Hey guys, if you want to dominate in Madden 18, head on over to Madden247.com where you can pick up the full access guide to Madden 18 and any ebooks. This is the best content that you're going to find anywhere and it's more than half off other websites. And if you want to support me directly, head on over to Patreon.com where not only are you going to be getting the best content, but you're also going to be entered into giveaways. So if you're interested, head on over to the links in the description below. What's up guys, in this video we're going to be going over one of the most popular and best plays used this year. Uh, it's out of the gun tight offset tight end. It's found in many playbooks. We're going to be going over it in the Saints. Uh, it's very popular uh, in the tournament scene. Uh, you see this is a great way to beat cover 2 because uh, we're going to get that uh, wheel type route on the outside. We're going to get that open and we have a hole that destroys cover 2, nickel blitz 2 any type of cover two defense um, this play will destroy it forces them to man up uh, that player and then we could also throw a drag underneath to have a, a guy uh, coming across so they force to use that uh, and then we could also you know put triangle on a drag and square on the end um, so we have like a double end read um, you see there we could dump it off underneath uh, and then of course like I said drag and put it in or deep uh, in square while we put triangle on a drag. It's all up to you really freestyling it on the left side of the field. The main thing is on the right side of the field. Now you can also use motion to get the um, receiver on the right. You can motion him out on that wheel route and get a little bit bigger separation from that safety if you like. If he's a little bit faster than the tight end, that's a great way to do it as well. Now to beat the cover two to the left side of the field, you can motion the tight end over uh, put them on a streak and you're going to have Cooks uh, get wide open in the hole. You could also put Sneed or whoever's your receiver over there in a flat uh, so you get a little bit cleaner of a uh, spot to throw it to so they can't really use it. Or you can motion um, uh, Fleener over, put them on an out route, put Sneed on the streak uh, and go from there. Uh, like I said, it's totally freestyle. Your main route is that uh, deep corner route to beat the cover to on the left side of the field. Uh, it also works if you bring um, Fleener over to the left and you run the inside zone right here. Uh, inside zone out of this formation is really, really good, really tough to stop. So they can't sit back and play pass defense all game because they have to respect the inside zone. Now against cover three, you can motion this uh, post or corner route over and it becomes a post and you see it gets wide, wide, wide open against cover three uh, for easily a one play touchdown. So that forces the user to cover that and then you can do anything you want with the running back. Put them on a curl, uh, put circle on an in, curl, whatever you want to do with the uh, the backside uh, circle route. Uh, you can have him for underneath in case um, they don't, I'm sorry, in case they do go and cover that, you have something underneath and vice versa. Uh, but that is forced to be uh, covered. And then of course, the bread and butter that you see the pros do is the high point pass uh, out of this formation. They'll either do the play action, cancel it, uh, and throw a quick high point pass to the tight end. So you want to make sure that you have a tall tight end, high catching traffic, high catching. Um, and then all you want to do, you can either cancel the play action as soon as the ball is hiked and throw a high point. Or you could just block the running back and uh, throw a high point pass as soon as you see the linebacker dip underneath. To throw a high point pass, you want to hold L1 and then press the receiver that you like to throw to. So in this case, it's X. So you're going to hold down L1 and press the X button. Now, if they're playing over the top coverage, uh, the high point pass might not be open. Uh, and then, of course, against man to man, it's not going to be open as well. Uh, so I like to do a drag underneath. So I have a band beater um, very quick. And then, of course, you know, you can put the running back on either side, put him on a route, block him, pick up blitzes, um, do whatever you like there. Uh, but this is, I'm not going to go over the whole scheme, but uh, one of the best plays and uh, formation scheme wise in the game this year. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like, comment, share, and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And be sure to check out Madden247.com where you can get the full access guide to Madden 18 and be entered into a chance to win a copy of Madden 18. And if you'd like to support me directly, head on over to Patreon.com. Not only are you going to be supporting me, but you're going to be getting the best content every single week in Madden.